Hey everyone, this is Blackbinder. Welcome back to the full Let's Play of Hollow Knight. Last time we left off, we had just defeated the first boss, and we made it a little bit farther than that. We made it to a, a Snail Shaman, that's what he was called. We made it to the Snail Shaman, and we learned a new move, a new soul move, and that basically it, just, it shoots a concentrated blast of soul in a certain direction whichever direction you're facing can't shoot it up but that's okay but what it does is it allows us to kill that armored armadillo that was blocking our way over here so we have we have a specific area that we are moving to so we should be able to move on fairly quickly this time around instead of wandering around like our first two episodes oh no yep starting it off good All right. Actually, I'm curious. I need... I'll need full soul, won't I? But I don't know if I'll be able to kill him with just one, ba one uh, bar of souls. I think they require a few more shots than that. But we'll see. Okay, so, oh, there we go, yep, I guess it makes him shoot these out now, too. I don't think I ever saw him shoot these out before. Uh, the other armadillo did, but that one didn't. Maybe the game recognizes that we now have the tools to go on. Alright, looks like we are getting some more green over here. Okay. Green path, yep. That is aptly named, sir. <laughs> Little soul birds. Uh, what is that? Get over here! Nope, he didn't drop anything I wanted. Oh, the stinky bug. I'm assuming that's what that... If I hit that orange stuff, it'll hurt. Ah, yep. Yeah. He exploded. That, that was sneaky, Team Cherry. Those are the names of the people who made this. Well, that didn't... Well, actually, that did work out. It put me back up here where I wanted to go. No more bombing me this time. I know I know your game. Watch him pull out another trick that I don't see coming. I think those green bushes just come out of the ground or something. I don't think I, you can... Oh, nice. I don't think you can tell that they're there right away. What was that? Venus flytrap? Oh, sneaky. And lots of coins, too. Nice. I think... Nope. Never mind. I was thinking we could go up there, but there's a wall. I just couldn't see it. Yep, see? He came out of the ground again. Okay. <laughs> Those birds look hilarious. They've got, like, the little soul faces. Or are they bats? They kind of have bat wings. We'll go up first. That sounds like a good plan. Yep. Very good plan. See, we rested. Let's look at our map. You do not have a map for this area. Okay, so we'll need to... Okay. So we can write the map, but only after we buy it for the area. Oh, there's a coin thing up there. Can you see it? These guys are getting more sneaky as the day goes by. Sneaky, sneaky. Alright. We went up. There's a bench there. Now that we're in the new area, I think we can buy the map from Cornifer. Or at least from his wife. Hopefully. Or maybe we have to find him in every new area that we go. Hiya! 
Ooh, that was good. Nope, I cannot quite make that. I want to go back up here. See what's over here first. I think that bug just farted at me. Lots of coins. Or geo, I think is what they call it in this game. They look like bug shells. Alright, don't gotta worry about his bomb, because he fell down. More coins. Awesome. I explained in one of the other videos, I'm gonna call them coins, because I will never remember to call them Geo. Okay, so we can't go... The only way we can go is over here. Okay. Come here. Hiya. I'll ninja you all day, sucker. Oh. Ha. Hiya. I want to drop this on him. Come over here. Hey, come over here. Come on. You can make it. Aw, oh, come on. Get over here. Yes. No coins. But I smashed him. I'm trying to figure out which way I'm supposed to go so I can go the other way. Don't want to miss any secrets. Potential secrets. <laughs> he farted at me again. How crass. Oh. I hear... And see the map pieces. You know what that means. Cornifer. Oh god! Cornifer is here somewhere. Okay. We can go down there, but let's go get Cornifer first. <laughs> Isn't this a contrast from the crossroads? Such a humid, lively place, the roads twist and turn in the most wonderful ways. I've done my best to chart the area ahead, though I must admit some of the area's inhabitants proved quite a nuisance. Definitely. Let's see what else he has to say. I ran into another traveler as I made my way down here. I tried to call out to her as she dashed past, but she barely even glanced in my direction. Not an appreciator of maps like you and I, obviously. Ah, uh, we met her as well. That lady who we could almost barely reach the ledge. Okay, so, can't come this way yet, but we did get the map. I'm going to remember that that's there one of these days. Oh, god dang it. I like to hit things, but it knocks you back, so maybe I should just stop swinging my sword at every chance, at every possibility. Nope, can't do that. I have to swing my sword. Come here. Those ones didn't blow up. I wonder why. Maybe there are different variations of the same enemy. Let's go down this way. There we go. Plenty of soul. And some more Geo coins. There we go. We can call them Geo coins. That is a good compromise. Can't go that way just yet. Oh, come on. I was more than close enough to reach that ledge. I mean, obviously I wasn't because I fell, but... Shut up. <laughs> That's how you get someone's attention. That's how you gain their trust. Immediately try to attack them. Honestly, I don't blame her for running away. I have a problem keeping my sword in its sheath. That that wasn't sexual. But she is a girl, so I don't know. Inspect, we found something. 
Those who stray from the White King's Road shall face the law of Un. What does that mean? Stay on the White King's Road. I'm sure that that... These thingies, maybe? I don't know. I will remember that for later. I hope that we will be able to upgrade our weapons and stuff later. Eh, like, I just, I like being able to upgrade weapons and such. Kill everything. Nobody gets out alive. Not even me. <laughs> Let's hope that doesn't turn out to be true. Like there's a house ah, over here. Guess he didn't like me killing all of his friends. All right, I think we're gonna have to use the downward attack. Yep. That wasn't too bad. I figured he would be a mini boss. Can I reach up there? <sighs> nope. Damn it! That knockback every time. I wonder if I get that charm that makes me more resilient after I get hit. I wonder if there's one of those for being knocked back. Let's heal. Damn it. Fast little bugger. Let's see what's up here. I know that lady's over there, but damn it. All right, let's follow the lady. We, we can come back to this in a bit. I'm guessing once we find her, there's something down there. I'm guessing once we find her, there will be a bench. Nope. I need some way to dash or skirt across the water first. I wonder if that's a charm down there. All right, lady, I'm catching you this time. Go. cannot out ninja me I'm smaller that means I'm more agile maybe the white king's road I wonder if that means to follow these little lanterns you can break them but I wonder if they respawn like a lot of the other destructibles do What is this? A toll machine with the symbol of a bench. Insert Geo? Sure. Give us that bench, that glorious bench. Let's look at our map. Alright, we have come a long way. There's been a few separate ways we could have gone. Some of them we can't reach just yet, but... You know what? Let's go up and to the left. I bet that it's going to show us the way to the boss every time when we buy the maps. Also, we keep finding these white lanterns as well. So follow the White King's Road to get to the boss. Who knows? I'm probably reading way too much into that. Oh, come on. It had already exploded. Up, up, up. What does that look like, folks? This thing. Team Cherry. This is a PG game. I actually don't know what rating it has. If I ever made a game, like a real game, I've made games, but nothing... I've never even published anything, just made tiny games. Um, if I ever made one, I'd hide penises in it everywhere. I probably wouldn't be a game developer for long. I'd be sued into bankruptcy. <laughs> I know we're supposed to go the other way, but I want to see what's over here first. Ooh, a bug knight.
Damn it. Yeah, take that, knight. Knight is no match for a ninja. Alright, since there was a little mini-boss here, let's see what he was hiding. No! Stay up. Maybe this is going to bring us back around to the crossroads. It actually feels like a new area, so I probably am not going the correct way. But we've committed, so let's just keep going. I hear someone. Let him go. Did that stun me? No. Take that, sir. All right, man. You look like an old version of me. What's up? Just what do you think you're doing? You dare to come between me and my prey? Is it a habit of yours to scurry about, getting in the way and causing bother? Know this, Kerr. I am Zote the Mighty, a knight of great renown. Cross me again and you'll find out why they call my weapon Life Ender. Is that because it ends lives? What are you still bothering me for? I'm a knight. I'm not interested in your childish games. I need my rest. Be gone, lest I draw my nail. What are you still bothering me for? I'm a knight, not inter, so I need my rest. Be gone, lest I draw my nail. I don't believe you, sir. We'll do one more time. He needs his rest, so I wonder if we come back after we rest at a bench. If his attitude will change. I wonder if this brought us back around to the area we were earlier. Oh, come on. Nope, you're not worth it, sir. I proved I could hit you. Oh, wow, these guys are regular enemies? I wonder if they're still as hard. Well, I guess we'll never know, because I, I blasted him. Oh, sweet. What is that? Oh my god, those are what those things are. I should have known that, because he came out of that one before. Damn it. Oh my gosh, I need a stronger nail. Right now my soul blast just completely out damages my nail. I mean it should, but I also just want a stronger weapon. Alright, so we were up there, so we need to go below us and to the left. No! I wasn't paying attention! Just gonna heal. Oh, how did I miss that? Oh well.
There is a stagway down here. Let's get the stagway first. In case we die, I wonder if it takes us back to Dirt Mouth. What is that over there? I guess we've already been over there, haven't we? No, oh, come here. I need soul. We will unlock the stagway, then come back up here. And hopefully there will be a boss that we can end the episode on. Stagway. Yes, insert Geo. Now, I don't know if that unlocks it for good. So I'm going to make sure I talk to him and see that I can travel somewhere. My, this, pl this place is much changed since last I saw it. The greenery grows so wild, the stations like to, the stations like to be consumed by it. Eager to travel the stagways? Just hop up on, hop upon the platform, give me the signal, and we'll soon be on our way. Alright, so Forgotten Crossroads, Dirt Mouth. Man, this, these tunnels look awesome on that map. Alright, let's go kill some bosses. And we have a lot of exploring to do this time around over here. Music got quiet. This is definitely a boss. Ooh, what's wrong with her? Come no closer, ghost. I've seen you creeping through the undergrowth, stalking me. Okay, so she's crazy. This old kingdom, a terrible thing awakens. I can smell it in the air. Excuse me. I know what you are. I know what you'd try to do. I cannot allow it. Jesus. So she's a triangle fighter. Jeez. I'm trying to heal if you can't tell. guessing oh, oh what the hell <laughs> my controller I accidentally unplugged the PlayStation USB kind of sucks it doesn't connect very well and she's just never gonna let me heal huh damn it I am screwed no I knew that was gonna happen <laughs> All right, we're right there, it doesn't matter. But our soul bottle is broken for some reason. Oh, maybe because we have to go back to our corpse? Let's just not die till we get there. No promises. Get up here, lady. You're going down this time. I've got full life, and I know what you do, so. Aw, cute. Ah! Not cute. Get out of me. Get out of here. So your corpse fights back. That's not nice. Damn it. Hegale, that is the bad one. Stay away from Hegale. Nope, I'm just gonna heal. We can do... No! God dang it, why do I do that? We're 
going to do two hits per. We could probably get away with three, but it's just safer if I don't. Damn it. What the heck is going on? I think my freaking controller is dying. I know that's a cop-out, but... Yep. Alright. Hold on, I gotta switch controllers. Alright. We'll try this one. Going from black to red. Red's better anyway. Keep wanting to jump on her head, but let's just avoid doing that. It looks cool, but 491. All right, lady, I need to beat some sense into you. I do not like games where, well, not that I don't like games, I don't like it when you touch an enemy, it hurts you. I would rather them, when they do specific attacks, that hurts you. Like Mario, that's one of my gripes with Mario. But I, you can't really blame it for Mario, because they don't do attack animations. But for games like this, my range is so, it's not small, but it's medium range. There's a little bit of a recovery period after you fire that, that you can't move. It's almost non-existent though. Kind of looks like a bunny rabbit. Gotcha. Test of resolve. No, you get over here. What does that give me? Mothwing cloak. Is that my dash? Yes. Right trigger to dash forwards. Use the cloak to dash quickly along the ground or through the air. That's going to make all of this a lot easier. Wait. Oh, darn it. I think it takes soul, so no, it won't make it a lot easier. What happened? Would it seek to break the seals? They cannot be undone. They must be undone. Let us sleep, little shadow. Return to your darkness. Allow us our peace. Ooh, scary bugs. It's a triumvirate. can't dash I don't have oh it's right trigger I was hitting right button let's do this yes I'm so happy that doesn't take 
uh, soul powers to do. I wonder how many, I'm not going to test it here, but I wonder how many we can do in a row. I wonder if it's only one per jump or per, uh, like if it resets when you get hit in the air. <clears throat> Lake of Un. Nope, he doesn't like me. I thought he was nice. Damn it. Nope. Maybe there's a bench in here. Yep, there's a bench. Is that that guy we saw up top by the big egg? Yep, it is. Hello, hello there. Seems we both tread far from the path. I can hardly believe those dusty old highways led to such a lush and lively place. This building su suggests some form of worship, though its idol has clearly been long forgotten. Doubles, e doubles equally well for a moment's respite. Respite? Respite? Bamate Juro. I saw a strange fellow out there. He seemed quite taken by the lake. I'd planned to offer greetings, though figured I'd first tend to my nail on chance our meeting goes poorly. Yeah, he didn't like me either. Your nail looks a fine interest, instrument, but it's showing signs of wear. I'd wager up there it would take you far. Down here, however, I suspect you'll soon meet dangers the surface world can't match. Hmm. Hollowness is perfect for vigilant, vigilant explorers like us, so tense and thrilling. In this place, you're either alert or you're dead. Or you're constantly healing. Hmm. Hollowness and blah, 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 blah. Okay, let's go kill that guy, and then we'll end the episode. I, I don't I don't like that he got be the best of us. Sucker. Gotcha, sucker. Nope, wrong button. Alright, well, that's where we're going to end it today. Please leave a like or comment below, and feel free to subscribe for more full Let's Plays like this one, StarCraft II, Wings of Liberty, and the, the Diablo 3, the new Necromancer class. We just started today. Awesome class. A lot of fun.